ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் ஒரு வெல்லி கன்ஃபியூஷன் என்ன மேம் லாஸ்ட் ஃபைவ் மந்த்ஸில் எவ்வளோ கொஷின்ஸ் ப்ராக்டிஸ் பண்ணணும் மேம் தேர் ஆர் மெனி வீடியோ சேங் தட் இந்த ஹண்ட்ரட் கொஷின் சால்வ் பண்ணினா யூ வில் பி ஏபிள் டு கிராக் நீட் இந்த டுவெண்ட்டி கொஷின் சால்வ் பண்ணினா பக்கா ஒன் ஆஃப் த கொஷன்ஸ் ஆர் கோயிங் டு கம் ஃப்ரம் யூர் நவ் லெட்ஸ் அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் த ரியாலிட்டி வாட் இஸ் த ஆக்சுவல் ட்ரூத் அபவுட் ஹவு மெனி கொஷின்ஸ் ஹேவ் டாப்பர்ஸ் ப்ராக்டிஸ் ஹவு மெனி கொஷின்ஸ் ஹேவ் எய்ம்ஸ் டாப்பர்ஸ் ப்ராக்டிஸ் ஆர் ஜிப்மர் ஆர் சிஎம்சி வெல்லூர் ஹூ எவர் இஸ் ரைட் நவ் தேர் ஹவு மெனி கொஷின்ஸ் டூ தே ப்ராக்டிஸ் அதுதான் இன்னைக்கு வந்து நம்ம சால்வ் பண்ண போறோம் ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் சோ ஐ வாண்ட் ஆல் ஆஃப் யூ டு ஸ்டே டியூ டில் தி எண்ட் அண்ட் ஆல்சோ அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் தட் வி ஆர் டூயிங் எவ்ரி சிங்கிள் வீடியோ டு ஹெல்ப் யூ அண்ட் யூ நோ க்ரோ பெட்டர் லேர்ன் பெட்டர் சோ ஐ வாண்ட் ஆல் ஆஃப் யூர் சப்போர்ட் பை சப்ஸ்கிரைபிங் டு த சேனல் ஓகே ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் பிகெஸ்ட் கன்ஃபியூஷன் கம்ஸ் இஸ் see when you are in class 11 the main problem the students face or right now if you are a dropper you are a class 12 student main issue is you forget whatever you studied in your class 11th okay and when you come to 12th what happens you are, there is no enough time for you to complete the syllabus and when you do part test all the mistakes starts repeating idu da main problem now ma'am if i solve 50 60 questions of each chapter it should be sorted or if i follow this uh, person and he is telling me that this 100 questions are enough adu vandu follow pannalama let me give you a reality check students if you are a student who is at a situation who is telling me ma'am i'll solve 50 to 60 questions of a chapter then there are certain criterias that i'm going to give you you have to answer genuinely yes or no to all of this question through the screen just keep answering yes or no and if you get all yes then i can tell you that yes follow this 100 questions follow this 200 question in the question in same thing is going to come first thing each chapter 50 to 60 question if you are in a position to solve depends on this if you have a error book if you have a error book and there is negligible almost no errors which says that it is a conceptual error that means what you are very good at the concepts you know all the concepts and because you understood all the concepts you have not made a single mistake in your you know uh, in the mock test that you have attended that which is a conceptual mistake if you are a student who is in that situation then yes chapter wise 50 60 mcqs will be more than enough second thing if you have complete mastery of your ncrt ncrt la ella lines me ma எனக்கு பை ஹார்ட் தான் மேம் summary lines uh, points to point ellame uh, i know so well that not even one word from ncrt i will be able to skip i know so much if you are in that position yes you can solve those 50 60 questions or ma'am i can attempt any new pattern question because in the ekalavya test series la vanda new pattern questions iruka assertion reason iruka statement based iruka diagram based questions iruka chronological order questions iruka so and the questions ellame enak solve panna mudiyum ma'am because i'm so confident enak vanda concept theriyum ma'am ncrt theriyum ma'am so i can solve any kind of question if you are a student like that then fall for the trap of solve this 100 questions and your neat is correct okay adhu kapra students any formula based questions physics la vanda enna formula kudte nanu i am going to solve the questions on that if you are in that position yes you can solve it now understood this is the criteria if you are telling me ma'am i will till the end of this year i am only going to solve 62 one second i'm only going to solve 60 to 50 questions each chapter then this is the criteria that you should get a tick on and i know majority of you would have told no for this why because students it's almost near impossible that we do not have any errors we know complete mastery of ncrt idu vandu or journey and the journey la vandu nam slow a slow a padichu da and in the level ku we will come so that is why i'm asking you why ask questions that how many test how many questions should i solve ma'am why ask that question until you reach you can, you should ask that question when you know when you feel like any kind of pattern questions i will be able to solve any formula based questions i'll be able to solve from one formula 10 different types of questions also i'll be able to solve in the level ke if you reached then you should ask me ma'am i have reached to this level can i now reduce the number of questions to 30 40 or 60 elena students it's not possible i hope this is clear to your head okay so instead of falling for traps like that ask yourself how many questions really is required for me to crack this neat 2026 correct no now listen to me here now students this is the number that one student gave us i know this number might come out very shocking to you people but ana you people ask me ma'am how much do toppers solve so adinala we had to give this number last year la nama topper vanda he got 623 marks okay in neat 2025 which is a difficult paper so and the student number da idu so adinala konjo high da irukku number idu vanda ningalku modify pannala okay he used to tell in his foundation stage that is 1 to 
two months. Okay, that is maybe November, December time. Mila. He used to solve 120 to 150 questions per day. That means on an average 3,000 to 4,000 question monthly and mainly he used to talk based on NCRT and topic wise question that means he used to do chapter test. He was a part of our Ekalavya batch so he used to do part test. Okay. Other students practice zone la. that is when you are getting into that Jan Feb month when the heat is very high he used to that is 3 to 4 months he used to solve 180 to 200 to 220 questions per day that used to go to 5000 to 6000 and he used to do mixed plus PYQs that is he used to not just do previous year question he used to do other random questions as well assertion reason statement based NCRT wise rumba questions irukkele tatva ala achievers question adu madri questions ala solve pani he used to come to this level adu kapra students final laps that is in the month of March and April he used to do up to 250 questions per day almost 6000 to 7000 question monthly and he used to do full test and mock review and that is when we understood namma vandu mock review you can help and that time we understood that his error book is conceptual errors one the room but card me are in the chair so other than all and the confidence one the normally it will come that okay I know the concept that is my my conceptual errors were less see if it is errors that is silly mistake copy pasting mistake that we can correct later also if you be little relaxed and do the test paper you can correct it but on a conceptual miss uh, you know mistakes are let's say in a percentage that is very high then students this question should never come in your head so you can understand Stand, he solved almost 20,000 to 25,000 questions and here focus on quality not quantity that also matters it's not just about solving any set of questions you have to solve good set of questions you have to solve questions which are neat level you shouldn't solve questions which are like you know uh, uh, like a very let's say PUC level or a board level or a, you know that level of questions you shouldn't solve you should solve good set of questions that is why I've given you the test series as well almost 25 students have got free test series so the offer has ended so I don't know like I I made sure that you people get the offer on time but many of you did not take it so that is why I'm telling you students see you learn the concepts now then you practice then you revise right now don't be in a worry that my god I'm solving you know I have solved 100 questions tomorrow I'll solve 80 questions don't be in that worry because other one there fake loop that you will only become a master of anything by practice and the practice rate one the increase on automatically number graph one the increase agum Elena graph will not increase so that is why I'm telling you follow this now students please understand for a normal let's say a topper also see what they do is they do subject wise splitting subject wise splitting means biology let's say 10,000 question every NCRT line by line they used to do chemistry around 6,000 physics around 7,000 here understand physics is one the one numerical okay from one numerical only like one formula only he used to do around 10 to 12 questions so you can imagine no the chapter let's say five formulas are there from five formulas used to solve this many questions so that way this number might look big now but you might have already solved many of the questions okay there are a lot of students who tell me ma'am i solved so many questions so it is very normal number don't shock get shocked looking at this number now what you have to do you have to invest your time and you have to divide your months that is very very important let's say you're a school going class 12 student see 5 30 to 7 a.m students you have to do quick revision and bio ncrt 8 a.m to 3 p.m you're in school or you're in coaching 5 to 8 p.m you have to do mcq practice physics and chemistry in the two to three hours let a maximum question solve panna try pannam students and other kapram and the maximum question solve panni other kapram error book le fill pannye aganam okay you should fill in this year the most stressed conversation that i've done is of the error book because error book like conceptual error come here automatically it gives us the motivation that yes the student is going to crack need and maybe he will also land in one of the top aims so under motivation automatically varum so adanala i'm telling you if you see in the error book that my conceptual errors are decreasing that is a sign that you are improving if it is increasing that is a sign that you are deproving okay and students 8 30 to 9 30 error log okay and plan for the next day one hour so before before bed plan what you're going to do next day so this way you will be in a proper routine to solve the set of questions okay now students see understand this student which i spoke about and the student one day he used to study 12 hours a day okay 12 hours a day either one the i like many toppers are there who are studied for 14 hours you don't worry about this but instead worry about your quality okay worry about quality in the 12 hours then on genna pandra the other plan bunny Correct.
okay five to six hours i'm studying and the five hours la where and all i can do mcq practice where and all i can do pyq practice adu vandu important so this is what is what you know the truth of it so make sure that you are taking quality over quantity maybe you cannot do 3000 questions it's okay but the questions that you have solved 1000 1200 questions you have solved should be really good quality questions so that is why i'm telling you if you want good quality it is definitely vedantu you can take it from us you want some help please let me know in the comment section and if you're watching me for the first time quickly subscribe to the channel and smash the like button and students let this never be a tension for you that how many questions do i solve ma'am because every day i get questions on my Instagram. Ma'am, I'm solving this many questions. Should I improve? Should I decrease? Should I, you know, you should decrease when I tell you your checklist should be done. All the checklists which I give you, if everywhere it is a yes, then you can reduce the number of questions. Otherwise, increasing the number of questions is the only way that you will become better in it. Okay, students. So, see you all in the next video. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.